Have you ever wondered why basements are so rare here in Arizona, while in other parts of the country, basements are the standard? Well, today we're diving deep, pun intended. So stick around as to why basements are so rare here in the desert. So we need to talk about the history of Arizona. And back in the early 20th century, when people were moving west, there was so much space that builders here in Arizona felt like there wasn't a need to build underground. One, there was so much space here that people felt like they could build outward rather than downward. Two, the frost line. There wasn't a need to build down underground because it never froze. So our frost line is almost always zero. So we're always building slab on grade. So in this situation, there was never a need to build underground because we didn't need to protect ourselves from the weather. And let's not forget, at that time, basements were considered an unnecessary expense. In this area of Phoenix, which at one point was orchards and farmland, is now a dense city. However, in Arizona, the geological challenges are a big deal as to why we don't dig down and create basements. So in this situation, the caliche in Arizona is really hard. So it actually creates a massive challenge for us to get down low enough to create a good enough space. Now here, where we are in Phoenix, makes it a little bit easier because this soil is a bit more soft and not as caliche dense as other areas of the valley like Scottsdale. Now also, we build basements in Gilbert as well, as you can see from Project Blow Your Mind. But you won't see them very often in Scottsdale. Scottsdale is a dense desert area that we don't typically touch and go down deep into the ground. However, like at Opulent Oasis, we are digging into the side of the mountain to make that process a multi-level tiered home. And also you might be wondering right now, I am in the bar lounge area at Cedar and Slate. The other room, which was right next door, is the arcade. Let's go ahead and move into the movie theater. So I don't think that it's really safe for us to say that basements are making a comeback in Arizona, as I think the standard was never even here. However, in today's building, basements are becoming more and more popular because one, people don't have the space to go outward as much anymore. People don't wanna go upward because two stories in Arizona are massively hot. Majority of people who have two-story homes that don't have a properly insulated home, or maybe they're built by a master plan builder here in the valley, often say that their homes on the second level in the summertime where it reaches about 115 degrees, say that it's hot. It's hot all of the time. And in Arizona, whether you have a single story home or a two story home, it's always hot. You're always trying to cool it. And when you go upward and it's not properly insulated, you're gonna have basically a sauna upstairs. So that's one of the challenges. So when you go down low and dig down deep into the ground, creating a basement, it's actually a much cooler environment. I am standing in the home theater here at Cedar and Slate. So this is a tiered system. You guys have seen videos about it, but anyways, it's significantly cooler down here right now than it is upstairs. It is December and it's about 70 degrees outside, but down here, we're probably in the 60s, probably about 62 to 65. So in this situation, going down because this is a single story home with a basement, this gives us an opportunity to keep it cool. And down here is all the fun activities. We've got the arcade, the bar, and the movie theater. So this 
is really an entertaining space for this home, which is super fun. So it's kind of the reverse of what we have in other parts of the country where we're protecting against the cold. Well, here in Arizona, people are building basements because they want to get down low for a cooler, more enjoyable climate during the summer. So as we wrap up this video, I want to ask you guys a question. Do you think that Arizona should have more basements or do you think that they're on the rise here in Arizona because people are starting to understand that if we get down into the ground, it's a cooler environment? Comment below. I'd like to hear from you and see our basements, the wave of the future here in Arizona. See you next time.